This is Adam Want, professor and technologist from John Jay College of Criminal Justice, which is part of the City University of New York. Today we'll be unboxing and looking at the differences between a MagSafe and a MagSafe 2 power adapter by Apple. I have a new 60 watt MagSafe and an 85 watt MagSafe 2, so let's unbox them and take a really good look at them right now. As we can see, the original MagSafe is shorter in length than the MagSafe 2. However, it is thicker. The MagSafe 2 is slightly thinner than the original MagSafe. They had to make the MagSafe 2 because the new version of the Apple laptops were so thin that the MagSafe was too thick to be able to insert into the housing. So the MagSafe 2 is slightly thinner but wider at the same time. First, an interesting story is that when Apple first came out with the MagSafe adapter, it was a straight plug like this, and then with the release of a MacBook Air, they actually made it a right angle adapter. The right angle adapter, in my opinion, is far superior because it sits flush on the machine, where the straight adapter sticks out and can easily be knocked off. Now, there are no adapters for you to use a MagSafe 2 on a MagSafe device. However, Apple has released an adapter which allows us to convert the MagSafe to a MagSafe 2 by just clipping it on. List the part number and exact price in the upper right hand corner of the screen. So you could buy this adapter from Apple, click it on to a MagSafe power adapter and now use it with new Apple MagSafe 2 compliant products.